Columbia approaching uh, the coast of California now. It will, it's predicted to cross the coast and be visible in the San Francisco area about 5.51 a.m. Central Time, or Pacific Standard Time, rather. And uh, almost uh, directly over, pass almost directly overhead of Sacramento, California. It actually crosses the California coast uh, just to the north of the San Francisco area. Columbia is on target for runway 33 at the Kennedy Space Center shuttle landing facility runway. Uh, subject of runway selection has been discussed and mission control continues to be discussed some, but uh, in the meanwhile at present uh, the original targeting for Columbia is toward runway 33. And as it approaches runway 33 it would perform a right overhead 212 degree turn to align with that runway around the heading alignment cylinder. An imaginary cylinder created by the microwave scan beam landing system at the shuttle runway that assists in the shuttle's guidance toward its final approach to the runway. Shuttle's altitude now 45 miles, speed 15,800 miles per hour, continuing in a right bank with wings angled 70 degrees, the first of four banks it performs to dissipate speed as it approaches landing. Columbia crossing uh, the California coast, again, uh, just to the north of the San Francisco area. Its course will take it across uh, Sacramento, California.
Okay, I got you. By guidance, we're processing drag. We could proceed them. Copy. Thank you. Flight GC. Go. Area grounds are enabled for the landing count. Thank you. Go. Yeah, we're just taking a few hits here. We're right up on top of the tail. Not too bad. Hydraulic return. Instrumentations. Uh, no, sir, there's not. We've also lost the uh, nose gear down talk back and the right main gear down talk back.
Columbia, Houston, UHF comm check. Flight. GC flight. Flight GC, lock the doors. Copy. 